good morning students so the next problem is draw the state diagram of sequence detector considering the mohr model with non overlapping so here we are considering the example 1101 okay so the number of bits are 4 in mohr model the number of states are n plus 1 okay so here the number of states are Five in Moore model, the number of bits are four. So then number of states will be n plus one. So four plus one five. First to draw the five states. One, two, three, four, five. so five states and then label as a b c d and e okay next draw the sequence when it is one it goes to the next state 1 0 2 3 4 5 okay the first state is called reset state initial state or idle state okay so in moore model the output should be inside the circle so here for the first state the output is zero okay next here the sequence is not a detected zero Zero, zero. For e one one zero one, so the required pattern is detected. Output should be one. Okay. Next, draw the square boxes. So here, write the bits detected at this state. at state b the bit detected is 1 for c the bit detected is or 1 1 for d what are the bits detected 1 1 0 1 1 0 for the last state 1 1 0 1 so these are the bits detected at that particular state next we identify what happened when it is 0 and when it is 1 for the first state when it is 1 the input is 1 it goes to the next state for 0 the input is not at match so it remains in the same state for 0 okay next consider for b when it is 1 it goes to the next state what happened when it is 0 compare these two bits 0 with 1 there is no match so then go to the reset state for input 0 okay next check for the c when it is 0 it goes to the next state we have to check for one input for two bit state compare two bits with two bits 1 1 1 1 there is a match if there is a match stay in the same state for 1 okay next 1 1 0 one, one, 1 1 0 when it is 1 it goes to the next state what happened when it is zero we have to check for zero now first compare three bits with three bits here 1 1 0 here 1 0 0 no match then go to the previous state and check with two bits 0 0 1 1 no match then go to the previous state again 1 check with last bit 
zero one zero no match if there is no match go to the reset state that is our first rule if there is no match with any one of the state then go to the previous state or reset state so then d2 a for input 0 okay now the last state again we have some rules so these are the rules for more model for non overlapping compare the last bit to the one bit state for more model compare the last bit to the one bit state for one bit overlapping compare the last two bits to the two bit state if there is a mismatch then one bit to the one bit state and so on for two bit overlapping compare the last three bits to the three bit state again same process if there is a mismatch then two bits to the two bit state again if there is any another mismatch then one bit to the one bit state okay so these are the rules for the more model here we are our problem is non overlapping compare the last bit to the one bit state so we have to check it for 0 and 1 1 0 1 these are the bits detected at this state now we have to check for 0 and check for 1 first compare the last bit with one bit state this is the one bit state here it is 1 0 no match then go to the reset state from e to a here the input is 0 okay now for one input compare the last bit with one bit state so here one one both the bits are match then go to that state one so this is for input one this is the state diagram of the given sequence considering more a model non overlapping method